Big day here in Nebraska as voters head to the polls for today's primaries. And at stake are votes for presidential nominees, legislative seats, candidates for local offices and boards, as well as bond measures. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Shante Passmore is live in the studio with all the latest information. Shante. Deanne and Matt, I visited polling precincts in Bill Douglas and Sarpy counties where people got their votes in first thing this morning. Officials in both counties predict voter turnout will be around 20% this year. There are nearly 13 legislative races with more than two contenders across the state. Right here in the metro, Don Bacon and Chip Maxwell are both running for the Republican nomination in a bid to unseat Democratic U.S. Representative Brad Ashford in the 2nd Congressional District. Voters tell KMTV this year's primary requires every single vote. Well, your vote really does count because if you don't, uh, some other party might get in. Well, I just feel it's my patriotic duty to vote. Um, there really wasn't much to vote on. <laughs> Some people told me they felt frustrated with this year's ballot options, but it gave them all the more reason to vote in the primary and for sure the general election. Now people will have until 8 tonight to cast their votes. Live in the News Center, Shantae Passmore, KMTV, Action 3 News Midday. Shantae, thanks.